Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernardo from the BJ Tech News Productions. Wow, I'm excited. Uh, more PowerShell coming to you guys. This is actually Windows 8 that I'm running PowerShell. And I want to show you guys how to use PowerShell to remove those multiple modern apps for Windows 8. Now, what's the whole purpose of this? Now, the whole purpose is this is more on the techie side. Now, if you are a IT professional or a system administrator or whomever's building the image for your company, most likely you want to remove nonsense out of the your image. One of the nonsense is the modern apps. Now I have uh, Windows PowerShell ISE open because I love the new interface because it's great. Now let's let's get started. Now one of the commands is git dash appx package. Now with the new PowerShell ISE with Windows 8, I'm loving it because it gives you a nice little tooltip of what you are writing. So I'm going to hit enter because that's what I want. Now this command right here, I'm going to run it and it's going to give me a list of all the modern apps that I have already, the apps that I have installed into this machine. As you can see, I have like Bing, I got the Microsoft camera, but most likely you don't want this nonsense. Now there's another command that you can run uh, I'm actually going to comment this out and another command that you could do is to remove it is rmov dash app package app x package now this application will remove all of them okay I'm actually going to run it but I want to give you one more uh, tip before I run this one now the next thing that you want to do is uh, you can actually pipe it so you could do a uh, get app x package pipe it to remove to remove app x there you go so you can actually put both of them together as is and you get the packages you get we're going to get the list and then it's going to remove it in one shot now if you want to do this now I think from my understanding if you do this command this command is only going to do it for the current user uh, so that means if someone else logs into the machine on a different account they're going to have those modern apps now if you want to do everything in one shot it destroys it for all the users this is the command that you guys want so it's going to be git appx package right uh, space dash all users we're going to pipe it and we're going to do the remove appx package now uh, I'm going to comment this one out and this is the one that I want to run and I am going to run it Ooh, as you can see uh, I got a couple of errors but I have a couple of completed ones so it's going over all the stuff that I could remove and some of them are failing I wonder why some of them are failing that's pretty strange so I want to check something out and I am going to go to my start whoa a lot has been removed which is crazy uh, I think this is pretty awesome I, I, I had a lot of apps I know uh, I didn't show you the apps that I already had on the start menu but believe me I had a bunch of I had a bunch of them right here in the start menu and I removed all of them I'm kinda of surprised some of them did fail to be removed but uh, it looks like Microsoft Media Play Ready cannot be removed. Um, framework couldn't be removed. There's a couple of them that were failed because you couldn't remove them. But other than that, everything else was removed. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave comments below and let me know what you guys think about this video. Are you, um, are you going to actually try and remove all the apps with your Windows 8 so you can like clean up? The, your image let me know shoot a comment below uh, as well please Twitter Facebook it please subscribe to get the latest and greatest tips and reviews on hardware and software and I catch you guys later peace out